the day the Lord has made. I will rejoice and be glad in it. This is Destiny Prayer Network International. I greet everyone under the sound of my voice in the name of the Lord Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. It's a good thing to give thanks unto the Lord and to sing praises unto thy name, O Most High. Join me together. Let's join the psalmist in Psalm 92 verse 1 to do that good thing, to give him thanks. The Bible says here, it's a good thing to give God thanks. So Father, we thank you for waking us up this morning. Thank you for making it possible for us to come before you in the place of prayer. We bless you, Lord. Holy Spirit, we welcome you. Help us to pray through. In Jesus' name, amen. Our test is taken from John 14, verse 27. John chapter 14, verse 27. Peace I live with you. My peace I give unto you, not as the word giveth. Give I unto you. Let not your heart be troubled, neither let it be afraid. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Father, I thank you for the assurance of peace. I thank you for the peace you've given. The peace that passeth all human understanding. Thank you for the peace. Child of God, I want you to join me this morning to thank the Lord. You say, Papa, but there's no peace in my marriage. I refuse to speak and to confess what I'm seeing, all the ugly things around me. Rather, I'm thanking the Lord with faith in my heart and say, Lord, thank you for peace in my home, peace in this marriage, peace over my womb, peace in my career. I thank you for the peace you gave. I thank you for your peace bestowed upon me. I receive it and I bless you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Every evil flow of bitterness into my life cease now. I command that flow to dry up. I command it to cease in the name of Jesus. Every flow, every evil flow of bitterness into my life of forgiveness. Son of God, if we are praying this morning, wherever the sound of my voice is reaching you, you are so bitter. Your husband has not been treating you where you're so angry. Your wife has not been uh, what you expected. You're so bitter. As or Whether it's your boss or your child or whatever, your colleague. Bitterness is like drink bitterness, unforgiveness, and that heart pain. You are so angry. It's like drinking poison and expecting someone else to die. Child of God, it will, it will hinder your prayer. Let it go. Someone you served so much, and here he is. He's, he has forgotten you just because another person came into his life. Whether male or female person entered his life. And that relationship of many years is strained. That you are so bitter. Having labored, I've given my best time, my youthful age to this man, to this woman. And here I am. You are so bitter. God feels you. But the thing is that God doesn't go against his principles. I want to encourage you this morning. Let it go. Let that flow dry up. Say, Father, it's paining me so much. I don't. I feel so bad, but help me, Holy Spirit of God. Let it go. So join me as we pray this prayer. That's why this program is reaching you at this time. Yes, every evil flow of bitterness, of anger, of envy, unforgiveness, every evil flow into my life cease now. Dry up in Jesus' name. We bless you this morning. It is done. For in Jesus' wonder working name, it is done. Amen. Thank you for joining in this prayer today. The Lord bless you richly in Jesus' name. Kindly share the link with your friends and loved ones. Please share the link and connect other people through prayers as you share the link. The Lord bless you in Jesus' name. Join me 6 a.m. every day. Expect great things from the Lord. Till I come your way, same time, same medium. It's me, Pat Diagi, saying, stay connected to God through prayers. In Jesus' name. Amen.